Once again, Battlestate Games has had to indirectly apologise on Twitter because Redditors and people on Twitter were crying really badly. The reason they were crying is because if you were to press Alt F3 to go into your Nvidia game filters, this now pops up. People can't make their game so colourful it looks like they're on acid anymore and that is a big problem. But don't worry, because Nvidia accidentally prematurely removed it. It wasn't meant to be removed until the 12.5 update, but they removed it a bit early. Only a couple of weeks early, but they removed it early, and it made people cry. So today, in this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly get your Nvidia game filters back for the time being, because you guys are crying. If you're not crying, if you're not one of those crying people, and you can play the game without it looking like you're on acid, then don't worry, you're fine. Enjoy the game, enjoy dying to lag. But if you are the cryy person, I'm here to help. Now, you can get around it, and it's very simple to get around, because if you were to go into your GeForce Experience, go to Game Filter or Alt F3, it says there is no supported game, even though you're in Tarkov. But that's only for new versions of GeForce Experience. If you have an older version, like the one I've linked in the description, you'll be fine. So the first thing you want to do is simply go to the control panel, programs and features where you would uninstall every program on your PC, and then you're going to want to find GeForce Experience and click on that, click uninstall slash change, or just right click uninstall, and then run through the uninstall procedure on your version of the GeForce Experience that doesn't allow you to use game filters. Once it's uninstalled, you're going to want to go to the link in the description and paste this into your browser or just click through to it. It is the official NVIDIA GeForce archive where you would download older versions of different pieces of software. And if you just follow the link in the description, it will download it directly without having to go through the rigmarole of finding the right version. The version I'm using is 3.20.0.118. And then what you want to do is once it's successfully downloaded, you want to run the installer for this. Once it's finished installing, sign in with your NVIDIA account because for some reason you need to do that with the newer versions of GeForce Experience. I miss the old days where you didn't, but nevertheless, sign in. Now that's done, you can run Escape from Tarkov again. Now that's done, if you press Alt F3, game filters will come up. Unlike before where it said unsupported game, and if you were to press Alt Z by default to bring up your GeForce experience, you can see that Game Filters is there and you can open it that way as well. So you can create whatever thing you want, really. Color, you can change the tint, you can make it intense and make it look as like you're on acid if you really want to. And there you go, that's pretty much it. It's there for you to mess around with and you can make it look like acid and different types of drugs if you really want to. But personally, I don't really use this sort of thing, but if you can't live without it, then here it is up until 12.5 when they add their own post FX and saturation and all that sort of stuff into the game themselves. So this is a workaround for the time being, but by 12.5 this will be just gone completely and you won't be able to do this sort of thing. So uh, if you want to use it, use it. Why not? There's no harm. Just do it for the time being and then cry when it goes again. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, like is always appreciated and subscribe to stay up to date with the latest talk of content. Uh, in the description is a Discord, merch store, all that fun stuff, social medias. Check it out if you want. I post things there. You love me there. And I'll see you in the next video. Lots of love. Stay safe. Goodbye.
I'd like to thank you all for staying to the end of this video, but before I end it, I want to tell you something about Shadow. Shadow is a company I'm working with to promote Max gaming PC settings anywhere you are. Shadow is a cloud-based subscription service, and currently in Europe, they're offering the ability to pre-order one of their free new tiers of membership, starting at only £12.99. Or if you live in the US, then Shadow continues to offer their regular subscription service for $30 a month. You can play any games, Mac settings, anywhere you are. If you have a broken down PC, a shitty laptop or even a Mac, you can still play games like Tarkov in Mac settings 1440p 60fps. And this is actually how I record all my gameplay and stream Tarkov at this point in time. So if you liked how the video looked in this video then check out the link in the description and it will take you to Shadow's website. You could do more research there and if you do decide to sign up using the code SAMOSH then you will get a discount on your first month. Thank you everyone for watching, toodle pip cheerio and enjoy your evening lads.